hello friends welcome back to my channel so today's video is about two to three years old what your child should be doing so many parents have asked me that what should my child be doing at this age is my child reaching the needed milestones and all these questions I've tried to put it in a video but this is going to be a three part so it's going to be a three part video on what you should expect your child to be doing from age two to three so as an early years educator a parent caregiver or parent to be this information is important and useful okay so the first part is personal social and emotional development goals what should my child be doing for my for his personal, social, and emotional goals. So, the second part will be communication and language goals, literacy goals. The third part will be mathematics goals, understanding the world. And the fourth part will be physical development goals, expressive art and design. So, for this video, we are going to be strictly going on part one and it's personal social and emotional development so if my child is two to three my child should be able to have self-confidence and self-awareness my child should be able to recognize himself or herself in the mirror know his or her name and respond accordingly separate from his caregiver or family member with support and encouragement from a familiar adult your child should be able to express his own preference and best and what are you when managing feelings and behavior when we are talking about managing feelings and behavior your child should be able to seek comfort from familiar adults when needed that is, if the child is feeling sad, happy, or, or any emotions is having, you should be able to seek comfort from familiar adults when needed. So your child should be able to express their own feelings such as sad, happy, cross, scared, worried. So your child should be able to say, I am sad, I am happy, I am angry, I am scared, or I am worried for two to three years old. So your child should be able to respond to the feelings and wishes of others. Your child should be aware that some actions can harm or hurt others. And your child should help or give comfort when others are distressed. Most children, they can give comfort, they can show comfort or help to give comfort when others are feeling sad or scared. Your child should show understanding and cooperate with some boundaries and routines. Your, your child can inhibit own actions to behaviors, e.g. stop themselves from doing something they shouldn't do. Your child is also should be able to develop the ability to distract himself or herself when upset. For example, engaging in a new play activity or just finding something to do to, to distract him or herself. Okay. For the next one on personal, social and emotional development, your child should be able to make relationship. Making relationship. My child at this age should be able to start joining other children in play. For two to three years old, it's uh, noticeable if you see your child only um, saying things like my toy, my house, my don't touch my toy, don't touch my phone, don't touch my... But as the child is going to two, three years old, the child should be able to share to join other children in playing. Your child should show affection and concern for people who are special to them. For example, saying sorry when the other child is hot or notice when someone is hot. Gives hugs and kisses to special friends and so on. So showing affection for 
for example, for a two to three year old child, he finds out his uh, friend fell down, he goes to the friend and gives the friend a hug, hug or say, oh, I'm sorry, or calls a familiar adult to point out that there is something going on with his friend, okay? Your child should be able to form special friendship with another child. Your child should be able to seek out others to share experiences. So as I said before, when children start joining other, they join other children to play. So they, they can share experiences, they can tell, they can start talking to other friends about what they did uh, during the weekend, if they played the ball, or tell the friend that this is how they played the ball at home. They form new rules and play to them. So thank you for watching. The part two of the video will be coming up very soon. Keep liking, watching, sharing, and subscribe for more videos. Thank you for watching. See you in my next video. Bye-bye.